Chicago is a city of green, a city that safeguards its precious environment. Welcome to Chicago at Play. All life on Earth depends on the energy emitted from the sun. The trick is harnessing that power into sustainable energy we can all use. The goal of the Park District is to look to renewable energy where and when it makes sense and is practical for our operations. In 2008, the Park District received several hundred solar thermal panels in a grant from the City of Chicago. We're looking at about across the Park District 10 locations to start with doing both domestic hot water and preheating pool water. The basic premise behind solar thermal energy is trapping the heat emitted from the sun to heat potable water. Solar thermal systems, it's a closed loop system. Which means that the fluid is constantly circulating between the panels and the hot water solar storage tank located somewhere else in the building. As the sun tracks through the sky, the parabolic trough captures that light and transfers it, redirects that light towards the pipes inside the panels. There's a liquid in the uh, panels in the pipes that goes down into our boilers, into our hot water storage tanks, and it brings a, a heated liquid from the roof down into those tanks and preheats the water in those tanks. What ends up happening is that the hot water storage tank for the building says to itself, I don't need any more hot water because I got plenty, and it doesn't have to kick in its burners, and that's where the savings come in. Generally speaking, we expect to see a savings in natural gas of anywhere between 50 and 75 percent of our natural gas usage, which obviously helps our bottom line. And the second major advantage is the reduction of carbon emissions, so you're able to uh, meet your energy demand load for your hot water needs without having to use up any fossil fuels, which create, when you burn them, carbon emissions. The Park District plans to install 470 solar thermal panels in the future. The majority of these will be utilized to heat park swimming pools. What you'll see with a um, pool installation is you won't just have four solar panels like you have here, but you could have 60, 70, 80 solar panels, which really give us a greater bang for our buck. At this facility here at Willie White Park, we're only using it for domestic hot water for showers and sinks and that sort of thing. But in a pool application, you're going to have a lot more panels that are going to be preheating a lot more hot water. Panels are locally manufactured by Solargenix uh, Chicago, a local company on the south side of Chicago. And we worked with Chicago Energy Solutions to put these panels up here on the roof at Willie White. Uh, what we're really trying to do is uh, find local solutions for uh, global challenges such as installing renewable energy on our facilities. Working with the Chicago Park District has actually been a real pleasure. They have a very proactive view about what they want to achieve. They really have a very unique understanding of the positive application of solar thermal for their facilities. Cutting costs while reducing our carbon footprint. A win-win for taxpayers and Mother Earth. We're proud and glad to follow the lead of the city and install solar panels uh, when we can and where they can, particularly on the, our facilities that have pools because that's a great use of this technology. It is a badge that says that I am doing, taking my role seriously here and I want to do my part. Solar thermal panels are one piece of the puzzle of our green initiatives. Obviously green is a core mission for the Chicago Park District uh, and whether it's energy efficiency, energy retrofits or renewable energy, we're using a broad brush approach to try to green our operations, green our facilities, and ultimately green our parks. 